Good morning, guys. It is um, a lovely Thursday morning, 10.46 a.m., and we're doing a self-care day. I'm doing my nails, my hair, my face today. I have to talk a little bit quicker because the kettle is going to start boiling in the back. I'm making coffee with Maxwell House and white sugar. Yeah, I guess that's the end of my speech. I'll see you guys when I'm making my coffee. <laughs> okay, guys. I'm glad I started the camera a little later because my dad just ripped a fat one. <laughs> Why do you record that? It's not like it did on camera. You better delete that. First, we're gonna put the coffee in the little cup. I don't have a good camera setup right now. Like, you guys are resting on a box of tea bags. Two. Teaspoons of this. Uno. Dose. Dose was close. Now we're gonna put the hot vata in here. Up to about there. And we're gonna get a big cup and put four ice cubes in it. Oh God. My mother is an extremely light sleeper. So when I wake up early, it actually scares the living hedge nuggets out of me. There's one more, but I gotta crack. I gotta crack this whole thing now. Oh, God damn it. Oh, she's awake. Guys, she's awake. I did it. That was me. That was my fault. Oh, she's coming. Oh, God. Okay, guys. Now that my mom's awake, I can actually make noise. Put hot in cold. Last morning, yesterday morning, I literally was just like out of it and I poured all this hot stuff straight on my hand. Straight on my hand, completely missed the cup. I don't know what was up with me that day. I never miss. I never miss. I never drop a single drop. I always put it perfectly in the cup. Where's the milk? Don't you love when somebody just doesn't put the milk bag in and open it? Culprit right over there. Primary suspect right over there. I didn't want to make noise because you guys were sleeping. This doesn't make noise. It makes noise. Everything no. makes noise. Snip snipped. Incubated. Guys, I have to check if I'm shooting in slow-mo because that last video was a pain in the bat. <laughs> Magnificent. Isn't it always the days where you have to do things that you don't have a good night's sleep? Exactly. Okay, on that note, I'll be upstairs. <laughs> Okay, I can't open my eyes. Now you know how we feel. <laughs> That's so funny. That was a racist joke. <laughs> Bye guys. Bye. Okay, what should we do first? Nails, face, hair, toes. <laughs> I've decided we're doing nails. But what color is the question? That's the real question -y. Guys, I want to start like streaming on Twitch. But number one, I did stream on Twitch for a little bit. I did like a water challenge with my friend. My thing doesn't work anymore. Like I open up Twitch studio and it doesn't work. They want to make it easy for me to start streaming. They want to make a little easy studio for me to like, you know, get my stuff down. And then it doesn't open after one use. We go in with our cuticle cutter. Okay, cuticle cutter. My nails are actually pretty perfect right now, so I'm just gonna clean them up a bit. Fun fact about me, I never get my nails done, like, ever. I think the first time and last time I got my nails done was like in grade eight for either grade eight grad or like when I went to Mexico. Guys, long nails are overrated is what I'm trying to say. Like, if you're a girl, you don't need to get long nails. Like, although I did see this post on Instagram saying, gay or guitar, and showed nails like this. Like, guys, we're not, like, just, maybe I just don't want to get my nails done. Like, cut in the cukes. But I also got these nail art pens recently. Maybe we should, like, fancy it up. Maybe. I recently got this, um file for my grandparents. Cucumbers. I mean, <laughs> avocados. I feel like <clears throat> one of those, like, I don't know, mean librarians or something. Or like a girl, like a secretary girl somewhere. Like, that's just like... I'm gonna take some acetone. <laughs> Acetony. 
and you know clean them up a bit before I put my nail polish on. I'm half Asian, you know, like it's kind of like in my blood to do this. Or math, but I'm leaning towards nails. <laughs> I'm gonna do this navy blue. This is where it gets tricky, y'all. This is where I start to panic, but it's okay. Like, that's what Q-tips and acetone are for. Look at that beauty. Commence painting. Hand one, done. Shoes! Oh, I really messed up this one. God, I really messed up. Here's the final product. Yeah, I know. I'm good. This is what we're doing today. It's the Fruit Babies best-selling kit. There's a gentle cleanser, pore tight toner, eye sleeping mask. Okay, why are these all sleeping things? And moisturizer. Okay, it's best-selling, guys. So uh, let's do a little review. I've actually always wanted to try this brand. First, let's try Blueberry Bounce Gentle Cleanser. Mmm, blueberry! Blueberry! Okay, now that we're soaking wet. Ugh. Okay. What the hedge? Okay, it's coming. I like cleansers that like really take the grime off, you know? It's not that satisfying, like it's just kind of like sinking into my skin. So let's just take it off. Okay, feels clean. Well, it's definitely cleansed. Watermelon Glow PHA plus BHA Pore Tight Toner. Hydration and pore refining. Hyaluronic acid, cactus water, and willow bark. Okay. Oh. Mmm! Smells like watermelon. Mmm! Guys, this is their best seller for a reason. I like this little kit. Okay. Oh. Okay, let me use this little bit. None should go to waste. Orbital eye area. No idea what orbital is. Around the eye, I guess. I've never done eye cream, like, ever. Mmm. Okay, what is the difference between this and regular cream? Like, I don't get it. I mean, it feels thicker, so. Okay. Brightening and firming. Apply a dime-sized amount of watermelon glow pink juice moisturizer. Now it's gonna do this stuff again. Oh, okay. Mmm. I love the smell of watermelon. It's so fresh. Next, as the final step, Apply watermelon glow sleeping mask and wash thoroughly. Oh my god! In the morning. Okay, let's let's maybe um I don't read the final stuff. Okay. Uh, well, maybe we'll just okay. Um, but I think I want to go and put my moist like my um my um my uh my uh my uh, my sunscreen on. I'll just put it on top of the moisturizer, I guess. So I guess that's like a nighttime routine because like all of it is like sleeping stuff. But I mean, I guess the eye mask you can put on during the day. Let me put some of the spray on because it makes me feel good. I recently got this fat oil thing. It's viral on TikTok right now, so I really like it. It's so glossy, I love it. So now that we've done my nails, my face, feeling plump, feeling firm, I wanna go pick out an outfit for my my party concert thing tomorrow. I really don't know what to, ex what to expect. It's also an indoor and outdoor party, so I have to think ahead for that. I'm thinking I wanna go a little bit grunge. This ripped top that I made myself with these like super grunge, like streetwear type vibe jeans, but then also shoes that I'm okay with being beat up, like people stepping on them and stuff, because I'm gonna be jumping. I'm gonna be. Okay, let's try and find this like holy black top that I actually made from pantyhose. Shout out CC Poo because she helped me make it. I don't know the last time I saw it and I don't know where it is. So uh, let's try and find it. <laughs> Okay, what the heck, man? That's all the places I can think of. I seriously don't know where else I could. What the heck, man? And the thing is, 
And I'll use them as regular black pantyhose. Ah! This is so frustrating. It took me a long time to make them too. So like, it's not just like a, oh, okay, yeah, I'll just make a new one. <laughs> Guys, I found it. Guys, I found it. I know it looks wacky. I know it looks wacky, I know. I'm gonna wear like a regular black tank top under it. It's also supposed to be two degrees and then turn to negative two, but you know, in my books, that's warm enough. I, um, I don't like this. <laughs> I don't like the tank top under it. I need a different tank top. Okay, now my options are either flared at the bottom or these, which are like heavy pockets. I'll try both of them on. Okay, I'm thinking these ones because I don't want to show like too much of my tummy. Maybe I'll wear like parachute pants. Ugh. Guys, maybe I should just change my top. Okay, maybe these khakis. Definitely a no. I look way too... Okay, not gonna lie. I think my best bet is these like tight green ones that are flared at the bottom. You guys haven't seen it yet. What do we think? I know my belt's not on properly, I know. Like, yeah, it shoves my tummy an uncomfortable amount, but then again, it's like, YOLO. You only live once. God, I really don't want to show my tummy like this. But I really want to wear this top. Ugh. Uh, yep, I've decided I am wearing these jeans. What kind of jacket? Oh my God. I know, like, what was the purpose of, like, <laughs> wearing this if I'm gonna wear this? But it's just if I take it off. This is the fit. It's not my favorite thing ever. Yeah, stop, stop. Okay, should I wear black belt? Silver belt. No, black belt. Silver black belt? Silver white belt. Yeah. Okay, and I'm gonna go for serious jewelry. Like crazy serious jewelry to the point where it's like, they know it's me that's coming from a mile away. I'm hurting their eyes with my drip. Should I go with choker? Are we going for sparkly vibe? No, we're going for chainy vibe. Chain. Okay, this is definitely a contender. That's what I'm talking about. So we have this, and we have this. Okay, tip. Never, ever, ever wear hoops to a concert, rave, party, anything. Let me tell you why. Let's say you're wearing hoops. Let's say you're wearing hoops. Woo! Somebody's hand. Your ear is done for. Bleeding all over your outfit. Done for. I have this bracelet that I'm gonna wear. Bitch, should I have another bracelet? Multiple bracelets? Kinda wanna go for like a lot of bracelets right now. And then on this side I can wear this one. Another chain. Yo, like isn't this kind of fire? Okay, I'm bringing all of them. And then, and then. Cause I'm a cinema bo. 